C4 Waterman proudly presents part two of the 2008 Steinlager Shaka Longboard Surf Series, the C4 Waterman Stand Up Paddle Surf Division. Out of the water, finished with this heat, is Liam Wilmot. Oh, good day, Tom. How are you going? Thanks for having me here. Let's click the mouse and get underway with the action. Here with Brian Kailana. Brian Kailana was taken off on a lot of rights, but he's also going left. Yeah, it's a really shifty day, you know, and you could find yourself on a four-foot wave like Nolan here, or you could find it, you know, swinging left at sunset, which isn't what people will usually do out there. But with the conditions the way it was, like Brian here, you could just find yourself in the position to take a left-hander on. It must be all of those things that I ain't been using. Later in this heat, you'll see me here, running with the board down to Brian. I wasn't quite sure what he wanted, but I figured he just needed a bigger board for the conditions. Oh, no, my board broke. Oh, your board broke? Yeah, my board broke, yeah. It's too bad, because that was my daughter's board. <laughs> <laughs> so, Chanel, you have a new board coming. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, during the board switch up, only Noel Martin was able to catch a wave. Brian getting back out there in the surf. Even with the switch up, Brian had already done enough to make it through to the semi finals. So he's just taking this one into the beach. And that's the end of Heat 1, moving into Heat 2 of Round 2. Out in the water, we have Kapono Nahina. Striking a massive pose going down the face of that wave. Trying to make the most of it, I guess. There was no water patrol out there that day, so, uh, I mean, if you took the wrong wave, you had a long paddle back out if there was a set behind it. It wasn't quite like the Kui Kaika where they had... Yeah, well, that was just an absolute dream come true. Big waves and jet ski pick up and drop you straight back at the takeoff. Also in the Kui Kaika, here's Dave Parmenter. He's advancing in this heat. He'll be going on to the semifinals. And there goes my friends playing another melody. Lyrics to help me. Here's Kai Salas on a real windy takeoff. Looking for some shoulder here. Oh, nice critical re entry. He's really happy with that little post re entry celebration. And have some sweet surrender. Dave Parmenter getting the last wave of the heat, advancing him to the semifinals. And look at that, already heat three, round two. Out in the water, surfer from the big island, Laleo Kinimaka. She's getting a nice long wave here and just working and trying to make the most of it all the way into Val's Reef. Val's Reef, it can get really interesting on the wave and kind of backwash you'll get. It uh, really can warp the wave out and create for some interesting sections. Kamu getting his fair share of waves today, competing in both the stand-up paddle surfing and the longboard division. Yeah, so did Ikaika Kalama. That's what being a waterman is all about. And here's a Kaika on a good size one from out the back. He's riding that thing high, almost getting inside a barrel. Yeah, really good effort from Ikaika on that wave, making the most of it. Both Kamu and Ikaika will be advancing to the semifinals along with Leleo Kinimaka here taking this wave all the way into the shoreline. Moving on to semifinals, heat number one. And music to set me free. So let me take in your sunset. Let me take Nolan Martin with a nice snap off the top there. What a great way to start off the heat. Nolan Martin getting several waves in this heat, advancing him to the finals. Yeah, also advancing was Laleo, Kenny Marka, who stuck with his game plan that had proved successful for him all day, which was staying wide and uh, negotiating that Val's Reef inside bowl. Coming up into the semi-finals, I mean the wind did not let up. 
I mean, you've probably seen through the footage, there's been kite surfers in the background. Look at the spray off the back of that wave. Just a huge extra factor to have to deal with on top of having to surf a uh, pretty heavy sunset. That's all I can see. <laughs> it's such a workout. Just the wind is real challenging. The wave is, is challenging enough, but with the wind factor, it's, it's crazy. You know, right now my legs burning, my abs burning, lungs burning. It's just, oh, crazy. Challenging. It's, it's not the wave itself. It's the position you put yourself in. Sometimes, it, twice I got trapped on the inside, you know, on the back end. And I think really you want to just go as far as you can in and get out through the rip. It's like playing chess out there, you know. And uh, you're the pawn and the ocean is the king. Brian will not be advancing to the finals. However, his good friend and teammate, Dave Parmenter, will be advancing to the finals along with Amuawai. He's surfing like a champ today on the inside, taking advantage of that Bales Reef. Look at that. Yeah, he really got that vertical. What a great effort by Carmen. And moving into the finals of the stand-up paddle surfing. And here to give us the results, the legendary judge, Jack Shipley. And the stand-up paddling, in case nobody's aware of it, this is like uh, something I think that's going to be just sweeping out there in the world. It's something that people can do anywhere, anytime, any kind of a water surface. It's an amazing thing. Absolutely amazing. So anyway, sorry guys, no money, but uh, it's a lot of pride here. In fourth place from the west side, Nolan Martin. the Kealana family and uh, we're gonna see this guy an awful lot he, he meets one of the criteria that's very important in this division and that's use of the paddle it's an exciting surfer and a very good one in third place mr. Kini Maka and uh, amazing performance and amazing surfer congratulations <laughs> In second place, uh, one of Hawaii's best watermen for many, many years, Mr. Dave Parmenter. And you're welcome, Big Dave. And, and uh, I tell you what, Kaimu gets the Ironman Award for this event. I don't know how in the world he could have surfed this many heats back to back and put in this kind of a performance but his performance in the stand-up thing was really beautiful. Congratulations, Kaimo Y. This is only the first of... Uh... As always, it's a ton of fun to have you around, Liam. When's the next contest? Kakaako on May 31st. Thanks for having me, Tom. Shoots, bra. And that will wrap it up for the Sunset Beach episode of the 2008 Steinlager Shaka Longboard Series brought to you by C4 Waterman. Visit c4waterman.com for all your stand-up paddle surfing needs. I'm your host, Tommy Stokes, saying aloha. All right.